What is going on guys, DBG here, and I'm going to do a full breakdown of this entire set in a little bit, but the collection reward for the Getting Buckets collection is the first diamond collection reward in NBA 2K18 my team, and it is Diamond Penny Hardaway. Yes, Diamond Penny Hardaway. So it is Ruby Penny, I still haven't got this card. So this Ruby card, which is free, is one of the toughest cards to play against. Even still, this card dominates, absolutely dominates in game. Like, it, one of the toughest players to come against. Like, I play small forwards a point guard just as penny stoppers. That's the only reason. But now, there is a diamond penny hardaway. Now, all I'm going to say is, thank God it's a collection reward. Because if it wasn't, it would be just GG. If this was a uh, pullable, GG. Hall of Fame Break Starter and Pick and Roll Maestro. Break Starter is the most useless badge ever because they still can't throw out the passes. Pick and Roll Maestro is an unbelievable one to have. It also comes with 18 gold badges. Some shooting badges, tire to score, acrobat. I assume he has posterizer, which, yeah, he has it as well. Some great, great defensive badges. But his stats are just absolutely incredible. 95 open shot mid, 85 open shot three. Struggled a little bit shooting wise, stats wise with this card. Like 82 open shot made, 80 open shot 3. But this card hit everything. Now this card is going to be even more overpowered. Plus 5 in shot 3 and plus 13 in open shot mid. As well as some great off dribble shot mid. 95 speed, 95 acceleration. Plus 10 in speed and acceleration. A 6 foot 7 point guard. Meaning he will be 99 system proficiency. More than likely in almost everything. 94 ball control, unbelievable. 95 speed with ball. Unbelievable defense, 90 on ball defense, 93 steal, 70 intangibles. 86 driving dunk. This card may not look stats wise as good as a card like a Danny Granger, but in game, this is probably up there with the diamond and pink diamond Kobe's as the best card in the game. And in my opinion, will probably end up being the best of all these collection rewards. So, anyway, that's the video. This card is absolutely incredible. I will do a breakdown in about an hour and a half, but I just wanted to get this one out quickly to tell you guys that this is the first diamond collection reward in NBA 2K18, my team. So anyway, that's the video. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe.